Here's the, the big thing. Write it down in your notes. The peace of God is connected to the presence of God. So more peace deep in your soul. I'm talking about soul talk here. I'm talking about deep things in here. You're not going to find it on Carnival Cruise. You're not going to find it on a trip. You're not going to find it on a fall foliage tour. You're not going to find it going to a sporting event. Those are all great. Love them all. Awesome. Hope you have a great time. All of those things, though, there's got to be a place in which you realize peace requires praying, not playing. And that's why we go on a vacation or we go to an event and we're worn out and we're so tired and it was supposed to give back and it actually took from. And instead, we've got to say there's praying that happens, not just playing that happens. And so that's got to be a part of the deal. I remember we went on a vacation and then we connected with some other parts of our family on vacation. And so they were staying here and we were staying here and we went over to where they're staying. We we're going to have a campfire. It's going to be a wonderful time. And so uh, I said, hey, does anybody have a Bible? This would be fun to read a verse. We have some kids read the verse. And uh, somebody grab your Bible. Nobody. These are all believers. I love them. All believers. Nobody brought their Bible on vacation. And I didn't say anything. I mean, you know, I'm the preacher in the family, blah, blah, blah. So I just keep quiet. I'm like, that's the best time to bring your Bible. Now you have the time to read it. Nobody had a Bible. I went to church. They all were believers in Christ, but nobody thought the Bible instead of sunglasses. It just got left. Playing has its place. Praying gets to your soul. And many of us are soul tired. Deep, deep soul tired. The trip's not going to do it. And an activity's not going to do it. And sporting event's not going to do it. And a movie's not going to do it. I do all those and love all those. They have their place. But it's not the same. Accidentally missing a meal is not the same as fasting a meal. Having a day off of work is not the same as having a Sabbath. You see it? Hey, thanks for watching. To find out more about Houston's First, you can subscribe to our channel or you can go to houstonsfirst.org.